You have to take my hat off for this one, Tanya. Now, Tanya, you're suffering from dry crotch. Dry crotch is something that everybody goes through, men and women. Easiest way for you to handle this is call that man back up on the phone. Now, this is very important, this next step. You need to get a footstool and put down right in a nice secure area. Put some plastic or something down just in case it gets messy. And you take a bar stool and put right in front of the footstool. Then, of course, you come out the back room, of course, with nothing on under the rug. The rug. <laughs> under the robe. Hopefully, you ain't got no rug. <laughs> but now, then when you get into the room where you got the footstool and the bar stool, Tanya, listen up. Here's where it gets real important. Don't tell the man nothing. Prop him down on the footstool. Take the robe off and sit on the bar stool. And if he can't figure out how to cure you, then I can't help you. I'm serious. But if he's willing to learn, I want you to grab him by his ears. But you'll be from a different angle, so your hands will be pulling from this side. Pull the ears closer towards the bottom of your body. You know, lean back in the chair. Make sure you have his ears and you guide him. If you do this correctly, Tanya, you will cure the dry spots, the dry crotch, and you will begin to be moistened. And that drum boom, 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 won't be this strong. You'll have a straight, steady vibration. Check this out. And if it doesn't work, I want you to call me. Get the number from Jim Riley. And we'll figure out some more remedies. But I figure that is the only way we can cure you without you going completely crazy. Oh, and I love that name. It might help to get the name put on a little donkey chain that hangs down to right there. That way, if you ever figure out what you have for dinner, you just look at the packaging. Thank you, Tanya. And you've been too.